This is a bullet. If we flick it, it will bounce away and not fire. To fire it, we need to hit the bottom of the bullet with more force. So we invented the firing pin, but this caused the bullet to be hit irregularly, to fire in a straight line. We also need a gun barrel, which has spirals inside. By placing the bullet inside and firing, it can shoot straight out. But each time reloading is troublesome, so we add another magazine. There is a spring at the bottom of the magazine. When the bullet on top is fired, the bullet below gets pushed into the chamber, ready for the next shot. Every time using a hammer to strike the firing pin is troublesome, so we change the ignition method. First, add a casing to fix them in place, then add a hammer behind the firing pin with a spring connected below the hammer. This way, when the hammer is pulled back, the spring below can be compressed. When the trigger is pulled, the spring is released, pushing the hammer to fire the bullet. The explosion of the gunpowder also moves the slide back, completing the ejection and cocking the firing pin, ready for the next shot. Congratulations, you have just successfully invented an automatic pistol.